got some explaining to do, Tiger. Trained from childhood as an Atlas assassin with over a thousand successful jobs to your name. Damn near killed my two best men before they brought you in. She said we're her best men. That makes me feel good. Ow. Here's how it is, Athena. I'm gonna ask you a single question. And if I don't like your answer, you will die. Aim at the prisoner. Now, I will ask you this only once. Why? That is a long story. After the fall of General Knox, I wandered Pandora as a hired gun. One day, I received a job offer from a low-level Hyperion programmer. Come to the moon, it said. Hunt a vault, be a hero. I didn't trust Hyperion, but I was too hungry to pass up a paying job. And what did you find? Violence, insanity, and a hero.
Vault Hunter, and thank you for answering Hyperion's summons. Unfortunately, the Helium Space Station is currently under attack by Insane Doll Military Forces. Please, take this Echo Device. Now, follow me! I can take you to your contractor liaison! Me, Rocket! Randy could have used some work, but A for effort! with great intensity. This robot died in horrific anger. Load up! Did that cloud trap die? <laughs> That's awesome! You're just hey, what you I need! Oh, this is Nisha. Why are you Let's tear some stuff up. The bandit who kills bandits. Uh, I'm especially looking forward to knowing you better. You need to just casually first. I got no idea who these asshole troops are or why they got a murder on for this base station, but they got me pinned. Forward! Pick them out! Fight! Fight! Attention, Hyperion. Your Helio space station now belongs to the Lost Legion. Surrender before it is too late. You saved my life, thank you. <laughs> Sorry. Heart's bounding. Never been shot at before. Kind of fun, actually. 
Look, these crazy bastards attacked Helio Station right after I sent for you guys. If we can drive them off, we'll be free to go after that vault on the moon's surface. All right, looks like you got a shield. Pretty self-explanatory. Bullets and bullets. Activate the defense controls. Two seconds. We'll have turrets, force fields, laser wires. Please. Won't know what hit them. Critical failure. Helios defense systems are being jammed. What? How? Jamming signal originates from Elvis. Pandora's. Oh crap! Kill the Can't take Helios back. We need to evacuate. Escape ships are this way. We must take this ground. Who's the crazy chick? I don't know. She leads these jackasses, I think. I don't know, but the first person to shoot her in the head gets a high five in a turbo mansion. All right, let me get this door. The escape ships are nearby. Son of a taint. Hey, it's that Colonel! Execute plan and shoot that chick in the head! Hello, Jack. Okay, that's unnerving. Run! Oh, perfect. She destroyed the ships. We gotta find another way out the station. What was up with that freaky alien? Uh, no idea, but I get the feeling it could kill us with its brain, so, you know, uh, keep running. Jack, what the hell is going on? I'm getting reports of alarms all across Helios. Uh, nothing, sir, nothing. Everything's fine. Just, uh, one of the cloud trap units tried to French kiss a light socket, sir. Need I remind you that you are there to observe Pandora. Nothing more. If you incur any damages to the Helios space station, I will personally... Uh, sorry, sir. We're... Connection, I... Uh, sir. Uh, sir. What? I called you an asshole because I thought I'd hung up. My bad. We will speak again, John. There's Elpis. That friggin' jamming signal is somewhere down on that cracked rock messing up all the cool security stuff up here. Son of a hey! Why the hell are you attacking us, you dicks? I want this station, and I want to save the universe. What the hell's that supposed to mean? So good, don't you? No! Don't do it! We just wanna leave, you jerk asses! They're just murdering workers, and us, if we don't move it.
Okay, well, I've got a stupid idea. We're gonna head to that moonshot cannon. Follow me. So what's this moonshot cannon you were talking about? Basically a huge gun that shoots supplies down to the moon's surface like at about a thousand miles an hour. We're gonna get in one of those containers and escape that way. That sounds pretty cool. We gonna die. I don't know. It'd be a pretty cool way to die though, huh? At the moonshot cannon! Move in! Doll guys wanted Jack dead? I had suspicions. Money, revenge. That said, whoever needed a reason out here. just began with us getting off a bus. This sounds all explosive and stuff. Stop complimenting the prisoner. Let's go, elevator. We can get in the moonshot up there. Let me get the elevator. Damn it, something's jamming the elevator up there. Weird idea. Uh, let me work the loading terminal. All right, you get to the moonshot 
cylinder and ride it up. Be a hell of a fall. Thanks for the warning, guy. Second largest bullet I've ever been in. Hold on, I'm gonna spin the cylinder. Get up there? Free up the elevator so I can join you. <laughs> hey man, is everything okay up there? Yeesh, she got wedged in tight. Eh, no big deal though, they can't feel pain. Just bash them out of there. Oh, these loaders pull me out. It's no wonder Dahl took us over so easily. I need more soldiers. Badasses. Like you. Woo! We made it. All right, we just gotta get into a moonship. A crate of Hyperion shall not... Yeah, kill this asshole! Saved my life. Uh, now we just gotta. Oh, for what the the auto shock controls are damaged. Someone's gotta stay back and launch the pods manually. I'd suggest Nisha, but you're way too pretty to die. That kind of stuff doesn't work on me, cowboy. All right, new plan. I'll stay behind. I need you down on the moon. You gotta find that jamming signal and shut it down. Otherwise, we'll never get control of the moon base, and we can kiss that vault goodbye. You sure about this? Probably gonna die up here. Ah, you saved my life a couple of times, I'm repaying the favor. Besides, I'm a hero, baby. Self-sacrifice is part of the job. Oh, good, a health machine. I had one put in here after a worker had an accident and, uh, lost his torso. Better heal up before your trip down to the moon. <laughs> Might want to grab some ammo, too. Supplies over here. This container ought to do the trick. Containers already, just get into it. I'm probably about to die, aren't I? <laughs> yeah, I'll see you after you shut down that jamming signal. Come on, hurry, we gotta get to Elpis and find that jamming signal. Jack, handsome Jack, the guy who murdered my boyfriend, stayed behind while you escaped? Like hell. Whether his decision was heroic or purely strategic, I can't say. But if Jack hadn't stayed behind to eject the pod, I might well have died on Helios. <laughs> Your story is making handsome Jack kind of sympathetic. I hate it. All right, we're ready to fire. Whenever you're ready, I'll shoot you to Concordia. It's the biggest town on Elpis. I know someone there who can help you find that jamming signal.
be salvage. You're about to die. You okay? Well, I can answer that. You're not okay. The second you open this door, all the oxygen is going to vent and you're going to suffocate. It'll hurt a lot and your eyes will pop like grapes when the pressure differential gets too harsh. So, here's my plan. When you're ready, open the door and follow me to my oxygen bubble. Sound good? Don't answer. Conserve your oxygen. Way. Don't think about the grapes thing. Here, I'll turn on this air dome generator so you can get a breather. It'd be embarrassing if you died now. Everybody good? Nice to meet ya. I'm Janie Springs, junk dealer. Who are you? Nisha. The outlaw bandit killer. I've heard of you. So what are you doing here? Need to get back to that big H in the sky. But there's a jamming signal somewhere on the moon. Gotta bust that first or we'll just get kicked out again. A jamming signal? Haven't noticed anything like that. You might want to get to Concordia. A little city run by a fella called the Merif. Gotta be somebody there who can help you. You'll need an O2 kit. Oz kits we call them. To survive the journey though. I've got some broken ones stashed nearby but I can repair them for you. Even if you ain't the breathing type, you'll be glad you've got an Oz kit. Head to these coordinates and clear the place out. used to be in one piece and not lava adjacent. Till the crackening anyway. for me too. Not excited about being mauled again. Voila! 
one Oz kick. Great for breathing, double jumping, and slamming enemies. Now, to repay me for saving your life, you're gonna end someone else's. His name's Deadlift. He's nearby and he's an asshole. He's also got something I'll need to get us into Concordia. You cleared the place out? I'm coming down. Just bring the broken Oz kit to me and I'll repair it for you. I need a new spanner. Deadlift leads a band of scavengers, scavs, who used to raid the old Dahl dig site. Colonel Zarpadon imprisoned them, but they escaped from Dahl's digging crack to the moon. Did you say Zarpadon? Anyway, he's got the Digistract key for my Zoomy stations. Killing him will get you to Concordia and make my week. Win-win! Looking for work? I got something for you. I need you to help. Huh? Throw you off? I meant to say, I need y'all to help me fix up some inspirational posters, y'all. Donuts, cowboys, homophobia. They sell like hotcakes on the black market, and I've already run out of kitten posters. Head to one of my jump pads. If you need to find me, I'll be back at my camp. of cameras at the apex of your jump. I just need you to get airborne and say something inspirational. Uh... Sorry. Say something inspirational, y'all. Always aim for the skull. All right, cool. This time, I'll throw up a couple of targets. Try to shoot them before you land and it'll make for an even better poster. And say something inspirational again. Black. Good, good. Now, big finale time. Get into the air, then slam down on that pressure pad by crouching. Then say something cool and look as badass as possible. Howdy, partner. Warning, oxygen levels at half. All right, that was cool. Now turn on the printer and it should spit out your posters. Kidding. Joke. Don't freak out. Hey, I got bored one day and started writing children's books, but I lost them. Can you find them for me? You could totes give me some feedback too.
Once upon a time, there was this moon. Then some military dudes came and started mining. They delved all deep and greedy and crap. Moon cracked open, people died, no one lived happily ever after. Finn, what do you think? Not enough gory details. I'll take it under advisement. I think there might be another one in my old camp. It got overrun by a crag and it's killed my... They killed her. Love this place! was a kragan named Flamey, who jumped out of the crack and bit Janie. She blew off its face, now there's no trace of the kragan who dared such cockamamie. Well? Why didn't you tell me you enjoyed killing things so much? We could be besties. Fair enough. Good feedback. Oh, that reminds me though, Flamey's son owes me a life and he's still out there. Track him down and get it for me, yeah? Great sack got big. Kill it. goes on an adventure. Baby Kragen crawled out of the crack with his mum, Flamey. They saw strange two-legged creatures and thought, they must be food. So Baby Kragen and his mum raided the camp. Flamey tore a two-legger up pretty bad, and Baby Kragen killed another one. Then Baby Kragen ran away like a little stupid piece of shit. That one must be corrupted or something, I don't know. Bring those back while I write another one about how you killed an evil fire monster. Sounds good to me. Atmosphere detected. I hate kragans. Some publishers are interested, but only if I cut out the parts where people and baby kragans die. I was like, nah. What's the story on this deadlift dude? Why you want him dead? He's kind of a dick. That it? Well, he also stole my Moonzumi Digistract key, stranded me out here and got really rude when I told him I wasn't into guys, but mainly the being a dick thing. Vault Hunter, this is Colonel Zarpadon. <laughs> you must leave Elpis. Things are about to get much worse. I don't want to kill you if I don't have to. That's too bad, because I bet I'll really enjoy killing you. Fine. Do what you will. Deadlift, this is Colonel Zarpadon. I need you to kill the Vault Hunters headed for your ship. Get them, Zarp. I ain't taking orders from the chick who threw me in prison. They said your jump pads are stupid. I will annihilate them!
atmosphere. approaching my ship, I will soar into the air and crush you with a butt slam. I like this guy. Posters. After all, I like to think I run a reputable organization. Delivery. Need your signature. I would be delighted! Great! Now give him the package! Thanks! Now get out of my sight! He's got the package? Cool! Now kill him! Guy's an asshole. What is this? Awesome! Now you just have to put the posters up all around the ship. Deadlift's men will try to kill you the entire time, but... gotten some blood on me before that thing ah, Only a few posters left. Don't die.
scary enough? I think it could have been scarier. Just two more and you're done. I'm incredibly happy that you're doing this for me. If that's not clear, it's only because I've spent several months isolated getting almost killed by Krakens. Still not quite intimidating enough. Must be my clothes. Not dark enough. Just put up one last poster and you're all done. Ugh, want to snap its neck. I overexposed the last set of pictures, so I used a cat photo instead. People like cats. Anyway, come on back. uses that jump pad as his front door. You might want to do the same. I disabled the jump pad! Forgive me, jump pad! I didn't mean it! Crap! Better head up to that geothermal substation, see what the damage is. Busted. Got an idea though. You could be the fuse. Huh? If you complete the circuit between those two live wires, it should reactivate the jump pad. Just stand between the two sparky bits. Sounds painful. <laughs> yep, gonna hurt lots. Right, now just go kill the guy so you can get to Concordia. Why are those Hyperion screwbags still alive? I never got to ride a jump pad. I also witnessed the deaths of many innocent people. But jump pads, though. and I can get you closer Death to Concordia and finding that Daniel signal. Fools. Those vault hunters die today. Or well, my name isn't Bucephalus Jedlift Macaroy. Time? <laughs> Yeah, you 
same I am. zoomies at the Dahl way station. Get yourself there, but be careful. Scavs have taken over that place after the Krakening. Never was good with direction. will and testament of Tom Thorson, doll captain. Deadlift scabs are boarding my ship as I speak. Whoever finds this echo, please find it in your heart to honor a doomed man's last wishes. Just press the next message button when you're ready. Sounds weird. I'm into it. Thanks. First off, I need you to inform Colonel Zarpadon of my death. Plug this echo recorder into a transmitter and convey the message. <laughs> Elbus was an old Dahl colony way back, but then the Krakening happened. Lava erupting everywhere had them buggering off pretty quick. They left whole factories here to rot, equipment just lying around. After a few years, the first fleet arrived. It wasn't the first one here, but that's what they called it. People started living here again. Maybe living's an overstatement, but people are here, amongst everything else. No one really knows why the Krakening happened, but most people you run into will say Dahl caused it. Extracting minerals or something. I don't know. I guess stories don't have to be true to be believed. They just have to be told. And I tell that one a lot. Big deal. I dare you to come over here and try that crap. Get over here so we can avenge Deadlift in his sick ass spacesuit.
Ah, oh, crap, I didn't think you'd actually come. for informing me of Captain Thorson's fate, Vault Hunter. Though you will not have my mercy, you do have my respect. Once you've told the Colonel of my death, I'd like you to avenge me. It looks like Squad, Deadlift's Lieutenant, is boarding my ship right now. If you could track him down and kill him, I'd appreciate it. says you're a dick. No! That's that. Sorry I can't give you a reward, but, you know, I'm dead. Still, thanks. Vault Hunter, I want to thank you for fulfilling Captain Thorson's last wishes. Head to the following coordinates. weapon stash months ago. You can have them until I take them back. Oh, 
some kragans while you're out there i'm looking to make make sure to stop by i got something that'll get you into concordia maybe you can find your signal there and get back to your ruddy huge space station hey you survived that was me high-fiving myself they're looking for me so i gotta go radio silent find the jamming signal shut it down and return to helios in my defense, those nuns were dicks. This. It's an Orbitron. It'll get you into Concordia. I had a cat. It died. Alright. Just jump that crap with your vehicle and you'll be well on your way to Concordia. Once you get there, you should be able to find your jamming signal. Or whatever you said. I'll meet you there later. And good luck with all your murders, Nisha. Thanks, kiddo. You won't find that a merchandise. Unfortunately, I forgot the combo to my safe, so you're just going to have to open it up the fun way. That shield will be your lockpick. Much about lasers? There's a light reactor stuffed in a building nearby that I can sell for a good chunk of money. If you get it for me, I can give you one of my spare laser weapons. I just gave you a prod gun. You'll need to piss off some kragans with it. Hi, new best friend. I'm from the Toy Corporation. Beat sorry. I didn't mean that as a come on, Misha. You're not quite my type. No harm done. I like him handsome anyway. Made it! The building with the light reactor should be nearby. Get inside. All oh, right. That's why I gave you the prod gun. Blast the kragans with it. They'll get angry and charge you. If you can lure them into the rubbish, they'll smash an opening for you. Which one?
broke away the rubbish. Now get inside and yoink the light reactor. trade you a laser gun. Or you could destroy it for me and get a cool toy gun. Why? Because I resent laser guns and I'm super good at holding crutches. It's a serious personality problem. Just drop the light reactor into some lava. Oh, I kind of feel sorry for the big bag of muscles. You can get the reactor to me or destroy it for Torg. I'll still like it either way. where I don't do anything. Oh, man! Everybody's enjoying their laser weapons, and I'm just sitting around making things explode! My life sucks! Oh, it's okay. People like explosions. <laughs> You're just saying that! People want lasers, not explosions! No! I really do like explosions. You're great! Really? Well, I like you now! Do you want to go out? Guys. Friend zone! Yeah! Alright, here's Athena telling the story about the light reactor thingy. I'd like to just point out that I was in a dark place back then, and I know that friend zoning is an imaginary misogynistic way of looking at relationships. You guys know what I mean. Please go away, Torg. Fair enough! Well! Warning, entering <laughs> vacuum. You should see a bunch of security devices around you. You'll need to disable all those at the same time to open the safe. Mother, I'm leaking them. That's my killing. Shock Nova Shield I gave you should disable all the security devices when it's triggered. Just need to deplete the shield and the Nova will fire. my password in the safe. Silly me. Anyway, come on back whenever. I hate Kragans. Yeah, a crowd poll if I ever saw one. Find a guy named Huckster. He's ex-Hyperion. Runs the town. Okay. 
Okay, that's far enough, Buster. Just give him the entry papers and make it snappy. Chop chop. You officious little sh. You're in violation of the verbal space morality statute. You just got a ticket. F you, I did. Oh, you just got another. I love rules. They make me powerful. Follow me or you'll get a third ticket. Yes, this is Concordia, mightiest of spaceports on Elpis. Too bad you'll be seeing it only from a cell for all those tickets you've accrued. Give him the Orbitron. Things will get weird, just so you know. Oh, great. Yeah, consider yourself totally cleared for decontamination. Boom! Told you I'd get you in. You're on your own now. Which one? At least I've got somewhere to live. Welcome, new city, son. Obey my commands. Go stand on decontamination pad. Do not move when beam comes. You move! Ah, go me into a clinic, silly Lapushka. I'm Nurse Nina. When you need medicine, you come see. Only a serious though. Nurse Nina hate big babies. Unless they're real babies. <laughs> Nurse Nina love them. You hurt. Here, take. Good, you better. When hurt again, can use vending machine to buy heels. You healthy, go! So, Huckster, the guy you need to find, calls himself Marif. Like, Mayor mixed with Shara is stupid, whatever. But he might know how to track down the signal. This guy's still pulling down a fat retirement plan from Hyperion, from my division. I'm basically his boss. He's pretty much on the team already. Visitors from Helios. Uh, so, here's the thing. Uh, uh, no visitors today. Whoa! You were one of us, you stupid named son of a bastard! Thank you for visiting the offices of the Merif. We hope you enjoyed your bureaucratic interactions. I uh, guess there is one other person who can help us, unfortunately. Get to the up over bar. Fig jam. Broke again. Five days a week. Where the hell's Mox? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hey, you see those two on the dance floor? The tattooed chick and the guy allergic to smiling? Oh, they're ex-Vault Hunters. Go see if they'll help. <laughs> oh, finally! Lady Luck flips a frickin' face card. Hey, Helios is being overrun by freaky doll forces. You up for helping me stop the signal that's jamming its systems? Hyperion, doll, is there a difference? We're on vacation, together. 
Yeah, sorry, but we're out of the vault hunting game. Too many tentacles. Tentacles, huh? Go talk to Moxie, damn it! Looking for me, sugar? Your ex sent me. He needs your help. And better taste, apparently. Nice to meet you, too. So, Jack sent you, huh? Must have bothered him something awful. No worries, though. It's all in the past. What does he need? There's a jamming signal around here that's screwing with Helios' defenses. I need to pull the plug on it. You want to find a signal? Then you gotta put transmitters on the Echo Towers around town. Get up high. Simple triangulation. They'll find the source, then you can shut it down. Thing is, I don't have any transmitters here, but that's fixable. First, I need you to pick up some moonstones mistakenly confiscated by the Customs Claptrap. Head over there and I'll update your echo. Trust me, it'll make sense. Oi! Can I get a bloody refill? What are you doing? You work here. What? Nah! I just look like that guy! I'm in off the street! Right. Two minutes, then you're off your break. That's not one. Moxie tells me you're here for her moonstones. I'm pretty sure I stored them at the bank. You can pick them up from there. I'm not a big fan of the bank. Still, it serves its purpose. You can use it to stash things you don't feel like carrying around. The stash, huh? That's where you can store items you want to swap between other characters. Not sure why he put the moonstones there. Jamie doesn't ticket himself for stupidity. Pick up the moonstones and take them to the black market. Show the moonstones to the guy there and you'll get what you need. I ordered a bunch of transmitters a while back, but I've been kind of avoiding this place. That Janie Springs keeps trying to use it as a place to accidentally run into me. What you want? These moonstones get me some transmitters? I'll throw them in if you take some of this other trash off my hands. So buy something. <laughs> yeah, Crazy Earl gets around. And he's a useful guy to know. Bring him moonstones and he'll get what you need. What you want? <laughs> Love that guy. I'll hit your echo with the cohorts for the towers and manage things from here. When you get the first transmitter in place, I'll make contact. Idiot. <laughs> One bone every minute. <laughs> Take it. <laughs> Works for me. You, you need to get above sp Springs Emporium O stuff. She's out of town, so she won't be around to help. And so we're clear. Tell Jack once this is done, we're all square. You can never be too well armed. I'm So, listen. I'll send you a waypoint showing how I'd try that climb. You know, 
because I'm nice like that. That's better. Give me a sec to get everything set up on this end. I, I don't understand, but, but she picked them up. Didn't come in person, sent someone. I'm just letting you know because you said to if anybody ever swung by for them. And she didn't mention me at all? Yeah, so, you see what I mean about that girl? The signal, it's not coming from Concordia. Coords for the next tower on your Echo. The hell am I? She's working now. Let's get her calibrated. I just gotta mess with some dials back here. Oh, Mama. You know why I no come back? I'm safe here. Company no know I'm here. Name is same because they expect me change it. Anyway, Mama. Mama, no cry. Nina must go. This transmitter, something's not working. Let's try rebooting it. There we go. There's a tower above the Marif's office. Try getting up there. turrets. You'll need to destroy them. Yeah, so looks like a bullet or two damaged the relay drive gearbox. Sift through those turrets. See if you can find a replacement. A relay what? Just, it's a thing that makes the transmitter work. That's it? Give me time to just... Blimey, you really know how to listen to a bloke's problems. I'll give you that. You sure I can't book you for more, uh, uh physical services? I'm a bloody stress volcano right now, and I could do with the, uh, with the, uh, relief. Oh, gross. I make it very clear to all my patrons, Serena is not for... I'll deal with our Marif later. Okay, everything looks set up. Head up to the control panel I've marked on your Echo. Activate it so I can initiate the final scan to pinpoint the signal's origin. It actually worked. Looks like the signal's coming from Crisis Scar, whatever that is. That's an old doll comms facility. Been nothing but scavs there for years. Well, looks like it's working again. Go shut it down. Uh, also, status updates still getting shot at, so if you wanted to hurry, that'd be cool. Attention, 
citizens of Concordia. Until further notice, for your own protection, the town is in lockdown. No one in or out. That is all. Okay? Oh, what the hell is wrong with this guy? This is so frustrating! Get back to Moxie. She's got secret exits everywhere. <laughs> Classic. <sighs> Some more of the if you're looking for Moxie Carver, she's not here. Really hard getting sucked when she's off in a secret workshop, tinkering with advanced tech and all. If I was any more annoyed, I'd probably let it slip and it's accessible by pushing the arm up on the one on band and machine over there. Then pressing the access button that pops out. Phew! Close one! That new internal dialogue filter chip I had installed a rip on me. And birds, bubbles and birds. Hey, lady. Hey, whoa, what are you doing? <clears throat> what are you doing in here? Nice, uh, nice overalls. Damn it, I really don't like people seeing me out of character. The hell do you want? Town's on lockdown. I need to get out. Can you help or what? I know a way out, but I ain't, <clears throat> won't show it to you unless you promise not to tell anyone what you saw here i hereby promise not to tell people the slutty clown is also a slutty mechanic we good great because if you spill my son would have to bury you alive in a shallow grave That's the way out of here. Hope you find that signal, and remember, shallow grave. <laughs> <laughs>